Dennis Evinger, incredible fight. I was extremely impressed. I have to say, um, when I seen the weight cut, I was worried. I mean, you look like you were really having a tough time with the weight cut. Uh, was it as hard as it looked to me, or am I just uh, maybe looking at it wrong? Uh, 10 pounds or 2 pounds, I still cry like a baby, so it doesn't matter. As soon as that water starts coming off, I don't care who you are, it hurts. And obviously, it didn't affect you in the cage because you did not lose any energy. It was impressive the way you dominated that fight. I mean, you, you took control of that fight. When you got out of the ground, you punished her from the first round to the last round. Did you expect the fight to go that way? Uh, yeah, I planned on doing damage as much as possible until she broke. And whether it be her body or her face, whatever I could hit, I was going to just, that's the way I win. I pound you out until you give up. So how does it feel now to have that belt on your waist? Again, I, I know you had made comments about, you know, you want to get some fights going, you're getting older. How, how does it feel to have that on there now? And does that rejuvenate? Do you see your career going a little further? Uh, you know, I, I, it ain't necessarily about the belt. I think just winning in general, I... I definitely see that making my career go farther. <laughs> um, I just don't want to, you know, be like all these girls that I came up with, losing their nerve and not fighting. You know, I just want to, I'm, I, I want to be badass forever. <laughs> Even well, when I'm a grandma, I'm badass. <laughs> and that's exactly it, because you can see you don't fight for the belt. You fight because you are badass and because you love to fight. And I think you proved that out there tonight because there was no sympathy in that cage. That was a brutal beat down of the champ. And uh, it made a big statement. I was really impressed. And I know you don't know what's coming next. You know, there's been some mentioning and everything. You've got to take a break. But would you like to fight quick? I mean, you don't want a lot of time off. Or would you like to take a break? No, I definitely I definitely like to turn over faster than uh, six months or a year. But, um, you know, I just go with what Shannon tells me they got for me. And, and I'm ready to go whenever. So. Well, you know what, Tanya? I would love to spend a lot more time with you. There's a lot of guys looking at me, and they want a piece of you, too. I'm just glad that you gave me the opportunity. And, uh, again, incredible fight. Um, say something nice to some of your friends. Give a little shout-out real quick. <laughs> what, to my sponsors? Uh, no, I, uh, you know, I just want to give a shout-out to my manager, Jay General, for definitely uh, hit, hitting all the good sponsors. I got a great group of sponsors behind me. They helped me out with my camp and made it made it to where I could train for three weeks <laughs> but I could train instead of work so you know I, I just uh, I'm just happy that that all came through and I was able to be in as good a shape as I was for this fight be ready I think you look better than ever out there tonight I really did so congratulations and, and thank you for your time thank you thank you the new champ Miss Evinger thank you